Hey, my Cancer babies, this is going to be your general message. We're going to see what's going on, what's taking place in your energy. Keep in mind, this can be past, present, or near future that hits the table. So take what resonates with you and leave what does not resonate with you. What is this energy? What is this energy here for Cancers? As I'm pre-shuffling, I'm hearing Capricorn. So some of you guys could be dealing with a Capricorn. Or you will be dealing with a Capricorn. Or you have it in your chart. What is this energy for Cancer in this time? We have the Three of Pentacles. We have the Nine of Swords. Some of you guys can be stressing about money, your career. The Knight of Swords to the Hangman as well here. Yeah, you could be stressing about your finances. Some of you guys can be like looking for a new job. Or you're hoping for a raise or a promotion or something. I'm also getting some of you guys are thinking about starting a business. You feel like you want like a side hustle, something that's going to bring you in more money so you can have that more stability, security, either that or you are a business owner and you're thinking about getting a part-time job or something on the side to have that extra money. Some of y'all also may need to get more sleep, okay? I'm getting something about get more sleep or you may feel restless or something like that. I'm getting a lot of decisions being made as well. A lot of sacrifices. Things taking place in your life. A lot of changes. I'm also picking up something about someone breaking a contract. Okay, so you, somebody's breaking some type of contract. I don't know who that's for. There's millions of cancers <laughs> around the world. So take that message how that goes. But something about breaking a contract here. I'm hearing cut in the cord. What's this energy for cancer? Thank you. Ten of swords. Yeah. The nine to the ten of swords. Someone could be stressing about some type of betrayal. Put yourself where you go. This could be you or them. They're going to be, I'm hearing secret. A secret betrayal. Someone didn't see something coming. I'm also hearing unexpected pregnancy. So take that how that goes. I'm just telling y'all what I'm channeling and what I'm seeing. Okay. Knight of Cups to the Three of Wands. Knight of Cups to the Knight of Swords. The divine is urging someone to take action on their dreams, their goals, the things that they actually want here. This could be you or someone else. Like, follow your heart. It could be you, Queen of Wands, Three of Wands. Like, take action, remain focused, stay determined. I'm also getting something about research. Somebody could be researching something. Either you did or you're going to be researching something. Or discovering something. What's this energy? Yeah, the Knight of Pentacles. I see you or something heading in like another direction. A different direction but this is gonna lead you to the four of wands and the ace of pentacles a new beginning something to celebrate you're being led in another direction from the universe in this time they want you to move forward be proud of yourself everything that you have accomplished how far you have gotten in life 
even through these sacrifices and things you needed to handle, things you needed to do, people that had you stressed out, hurt you, lied to you, betrayed you, stabbed you in the back, or you felt stabbed you in the back. It's like, move forward from this. And I see a lot of you guys doing that. I see a lot of y'all moving forward from a lot of things that could have taken place in your past even things going on in the present moment. You're not letting everything get to you. Yeah, look. Death card to the will of fortune. A shift is taking place. Confirmation. A shift is taking place here. Aquarius, Gemini, Scorpio, Leo energy, Pisces, Cancer energy. Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. Let's get some more. Let's get some more messages. I see a lot of things going in your favor. It's like you're walking right into some type of change. You're going through a powerful awakening in this time. A lot of things have to come to an end in order for you to see change, growth, a lot of things that you've been working hard for. It is hard to accept, okay, but you will get through it. I'm also getting a message that something about someone that wears glasses, somebody wears glasses or you're going to meet someone that wears glasses and they're going to be a user, don't trust them or this already happened. Someone with glasses. Okay. Somebody could be a liar. Yeah. Life is full of surprises. With shifted perspective. Yeah. Your per like your perspective on something has changed or it will change for someone. Yeah, someone wants you to help them. There may be someone that wants you to help them. Stop running and face your fears. Face things head on. How can I get you back? How can I get you to trust me again? Somebody wants your trust, okay? But this can be someone that doesn't want to face their fears. They don't want to step up. They don't want to do something right. This person may also be going through things. I think I just said something about a, somebody that wears glasses could be a user or someone's a liar. So be careful of that. Because you could be a workaholic or somebody else is. Yeah, something about blockages here for someone as well. There could be some type of blockages or there's a third party that's trying to cause blockages between you and whoever this person is or you and someone so I'm getting a lot of random messages here, Cancers. So just take what resonates with you. Leave what does not resonate with you. This is kind of a day, I guess. <laughs> I'm picking up on like random things for people all around the world. It's not a specific story here. It's just different things today. Okay, so take what resonates. Some of y'all may start working out or you're getting into that. Or that's something you're thinking about doing comedian here there may be something that makes you laugh or a movie you watch that's gonna make you laugh okay you are getting redirected didn't i just say that right here with this knight of pentacles will of fortune death card you're being directed in another position being put somewhere else what did i say position somebody could be getting a new position i don't know why i said that but you're being redirected into another like you know place in another direction for a reason yeah sometimes bad things happen in our life that put us directly on the path we need to be on there can be someone that's realizing the grass wasn't greener on the other side okay and this could be a third party situation going wrong so for some of you that is 
some of your situation. You could be dealing with someone here that may be receiving a lot of blockages in their life. And it could be their karma due to putting you in a third party. Or there's a third party that's trying to cause blockages for you and someone coming back together. Maybe it caused issues already. And you don't trust this person with this. How can I get you to trust me again? They need your help. They want to know what they have to do to get you to trust them again. Someone's coming back in for some of you. Okay? Y'all got someone coming back in. Yeah. After a permanent ending. Didn't I say? I said somebody was being used. This person can have glasses. Don't have to be. But being used and will all be exposed soon. So there could be a permanent ending going on with a third party and a person you used to deal with or something. For some of you. There's a permanent ending here. Toxic relationship. This person could be finding out this karmic was using them. A third party or something. So... That can be for someone. There is a story, a little story here, but everything else is like random. Okay, Cancers? Yeah. What's this energy for Cancers? More than friends, speak your truth. Stop running and trust the universe. Negative people don't deserve your energy. Yeah, there is someone that's learning a lot of lessons. In this time, you're being redirected, but someone else is going through an awakening, a realization as well. To stop running and trust the universe, speak your truth. How do you feel? This could be someone that's always wanted to be with you, or they think about you a lot, or they left you or something for a third party. Take out how it resonates, or all the above. But you are like moving away from negative energies negative people you're being guided to move away from people like that negative people don't deserve your energy spirit is telling you to listen to a song in your phone or on your playlist the fifth song and the 20th song may have a message okay the fifth and 20th song on your playlist go listen to it a message from the divine yeah look 444 Trust the guidance being given to you. I keep saying that. You guys are being redirected, guided to do certain things. Somebody has a deep love, okay, for something or someone. Powerful connection to the spiritual realm. Okay, someone has heavy protection surrounding them. Spirit is saying that you got key, the key to open many doors. Yeah, very spiritually connected. Yeah, blessings. A lot of blessings coming in for you. Cancer, beautiful message. Really beautiful message here. Before I close this out, let me look at y'all finances. Let's see how y'all finances are going to be looking between now and the next three months, closing this year out. I do see like a job change. I said that up here, something about a job change. All right. We have the past. Look to the past to understand the future, a lesson, an experience, and an old skill. So something from your past may come up. That's that starting a business for some of you or getting into a hobby, okay? You could be earning or receiving money from something that you did in the past. Either you're going to go back to doing something that you love for some of you. They want you to think rich and think wealthy. Have an abundant mindset. Because a lot is coming in for you. You're about to, Yeah, you're about to be very comfortable. Just trying to come out. You're about to be very comfortable. Your finances are in, in the state of balance. You're entering the most comfortable period of your life. Yeah, a lot of changes coming in. Look, use your skills to create. Like, look, something about a hobby or a skill. You're going to have long-term stability. Beautiful energy. And this is this is Spirit saying this is your year. Look, job change, like I said. I said that too in the beginning of the message. So that's confirmation. Look, and I also said a job offer. <laughs> Some of y'all got job offers coming in. You're starting businesses. This is really going to be your year. Your life is about to change, closing this year out. For some of you in the next three months, like I said, going into next year, next year is going to be even better. So money looking really good. Let's close this out. Loving this energy. 
Loving it, loving it, loving it. <laughs> also, you guys, I'm going to leave my other information below for my other platforms. Go follow it. Go shop in the spiritual store. It is now open. Hit that like button and that subscribe button as well. I would love to see you coming back here on my channel. Join my fam bam over here. What is this energy for cancers? Look, trust in your intuition. On your journey, spirit wants you to trust your, you know, your journey and trust your intuition. Use your discernment on this journey that you're going to be on. It's a lot about the change in your life, money-wise, your love life. I'm also hearing with family for some of you. A lot of changes are coming in. So they want you to trust your intuition. Didn't I just say you, you hold the key to a door? Don't this look like a key? I'm getting that. A key lock. Look, a key lock. My life is truly guided. I'm telling you, this whole message was about you entering a new cycle in your life and leaving a lot of things behind in order for all these changes and beautiful things to come in. It's time to leave a lot of things behind, okay? So doors are opening for you, but trust your intuition because you do have a lot of blessings coming your way and you're in this healing energy. It's time. It's time. It's time for these changes. You're in healing energy. So, 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 so happy for you guys in this time. Love you guys. All right, y'all. That is the message. That is the tea. And I'm going to leave it here. And I'm going to go do the other zodiacs. I have five more to do. I have Scorpio, Pisces, um, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus left. So I'm going to try to get those done. Hopefully all of them done today. Between today and tomorrow. So see y'all in the next message. Love you guys. Bye.